recording starts, here we go. Oh, wait, let me uh, hit that button. There we go. Hi. I went to look for the map that was uh, given to us by Lemons a couple of days ago, and then I went to uh, look at the comment, and it disappeared. So I don't know what actually happened. Sorry, it disappeared, but I scrambled a bit and went looking for something else. I may have done this map before, but it's called the uh, Geo Detective. So it says we should be able to basically guess where this is. Kind of from 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 the the exact spot we're in. We'll see how it goes with my ability to uh, pinpoint locations. And we'll we'll see how bad I do. Anyway, how we doing? It's uh, Friday. For any of the new people who've recently just subscribed, I don't know if you've been watching it beforehand or not, but hey, welcome. Hope you enjoy your stay. Thank you for the subscriptions and the continued doing. I don't know if I'm gonna get this just from from this. This almost this feels like. Spain or Portugal? It also could be Italy? Ari Demento. Like looking at these trash cans. He says that if I'm a decent enough geoguesser, you should be able to get it from 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 here, but I'm not I'm not seeing it. Are these potentially dishes, not port not not flags? I'm gonna move forward. Because I'm a bad geoguesser player, and I'm sorry, but I I cannot figure out where we are. I'm I'm resigning myself to know that. Never admitted to being a uh, good geoguesser player at all. Let me take a sip. But I'm gonna try my damnedest. God damn it. Um, how we doing? It's uh, our Friday. I am doing this the day before, just because of recent circumstances of basically being home all the time. San Marino. Ah, I almost thought I could have been here too. Isn't that... Shit. San Marino is... Uh, isn't it? Oh, man, I am... Overthinking this, I think. San Marino. I feel I've seen that word somewhere before, and it's it's driving me nuts. The more Autostrada, Romini. God damn it. San Marino. Pandora? No. That'd be dumb. Oh, man. I feel like this is such a, this has to have been like a word somewhere that I've seen before, but for whatever fucking reason, nope, brain's just refusing to work. It gets snow here. It's a pretty nice looking place. Oh, man. I got 43 seconds. And I'm... I, I don't know. I, I really don't. I've got 30 seconds, and it's just panic at this point. It's got to be Spain, uh, Italy. San Marino. I'm going to click, like, here. San Marino. It's an actual... It's its own thing? Have I not known that? I feel like I should have known that. Interesting. I didn't know if this actually ends up being it. I take a sip while we wait. Um, yeah, it's Friday. It's uh, exciting times for you and I. San, yeah, there. I don't think I was going to see a San Marino thing anywhere on that first screen, looking back at it now. Maybe those actually were flags in that roof, because I want to say I know what San Marino's flag is, but... Uh, I, I'm... I'm not normally 
a uh what's what's the word confident person when it comes to things like this anyway friday enough talk here we go well not enough talk that's kind of just the whole point of this as i guess places here um how's your week been been a been a weird one the new normal for the time being um yeah, I've had some fun actually this week. I don't know why I, did, I forgot about this before, but um, certain things you never think you actually have issues with until it actually happens. It's like a, someone took a three hats. One thing was like a sort of infest, infestation of some sort. The other one was a location in your... Uh, uh, it was a location in your house. And then the final one was, I guess, time of year. Um, I didn't really think out that third one so much, but basically, long story short, I got bees. Like, it was weird. A couple of days ago, I was, uh, just say we're in Surabaya, but I, I, I don't know. It could be any of these goddamn places. It's a, it's a large country. Um, a couple of days ago, I forget exactly what I was doing, but I was in my living room. Oh, this was after the uh, potential illness. That kind of just turned into nothing. It was kind of just that day, and then it went away. Um, I was in my living room, and I heard, like, fly noise up against my wall. And I was like, oh, that's weird. What is that? Didn't think anything of it. I eventually walked over to the window to finally see what it was. And then I looked down on the bottom of my uh, sliding glass door, and there was a bee. It was a weird-looking bee. And then, not too far from it was a second. I'm like, well, shit, they're, they're alive. One of the things I am not fans of are bees. Like, I'm fine with them existing and doing their own thing, just preferably not around me and extremely not preferably in my house. Or apartment, excuse me, I don't want to get terminology incorrect here. So, killed those two. I was like, oh, that is strange. And then I just happened to see another one. And it's like in that little, if you have a sliding glass door, that middle like bar piece in the center between the two panes, window door things, whatever they're called. I'm like, huh, maybe they're getting out of that. Took care of that one. Opened it up to look to see what it was. I still no idea because I don't feel I've seen these type of bees before. And shut the door, saw another one. I'm like, well, four bees in one place kind of is a bit unsettling for most people, especially. In your house, apartment, whatever. Um, so, yeah, I was uh, safe to say very concerned and decided to, uh, number one, look into it. Although maybe the order of these things should have been done a different way. I looked it up, couldn't really tell. I had it down to two different types, but none of them really matched. And then I finally decided to call the landlord and say, hey, I got bees. Hmm. And after talking to the to the soup superintendent, he's like, "Yeah, that." He he started laughing. He's like, "Fucking bees, really?" I'm like, "Yeah, I didn't know either." Saved the little carcasses of them, and so he could look at them. He's like, "Yeah, those definitely are bees. I don't know what they are either, but uh, Iller Timor, we're in the Isle of Timor. Are we in Kupang? I'm just gonna say we're there. No, we were uh." Well, I was closer on the Palambang on the other one there. Um, he was like, yeah, I mean, I'll look into it and get back to you on it. And I'll let you know. Oh, we're near Bucharest, huh? Bucharesti. All right. Um, yeah, so basically I've been spending the majority of the past couple of days just being like, all right. It's been an hour. Are there any bees? Okay, there isn't. How about now? You know, just constantly looking for fucking bees. Because I don't want bees in my house. I don't want to sit there and have them uh, sting me in some uh, inconvenient time where I'm, like, sleeping or something. It's, it's not what I want to do. E87. Where are you? Excuse me. I see 83. E87, okay. And Tulsia? 
we're near 22. There's Tulsia. 22. Maybe we're like here. But anyway, uh, after a couple hours, the guy finally came back and looked at me, uh, called me up. And then told me, he's like, hey, it's probably uh, um, something called cellophane bees, which is something I'd never heard of before, but I decided to actually go and look at it. And uh, yeah, I was like, oh, these things exist. And it, and it led me to uh, think that, oh, what are, they, what are they like? And then I was reading about them. They're like, they dig in, dig in the ground. They make little individual nests and they make their they they line their nests with basically polyester and they're also called like polyester bees it, they're they're crazy things but they're like completely harmless you know not very aggressive at all but you know regardless it may be true i still don't want a goddamn bee in my house uh found that out and then decided to go back out into my living room again saw another bee on the window, and I'm like, great. It's exactly not what I want. And decided to finally go get some bee repellent. Um, thanks to the pandemic, my local small town hardware store has very specific hours, and they close extremely early. So they weren't open. Like, oh, maybe the grocery store's got it. Nope. Um, so I went back to my house, and was like, well, I got, what was it, Deep Woods Off, I think it's called, just mosquito thing. And figured, well, I got nothing else. Might as well go with that. And just sprayed the inside of my window with a friggin' off spray. I mean, compared to the past couple of days, it, it's pretty cold today. And it actually snowed. So, mm, hoping it's taken care of. I mean, they kind of are individualists in the sense that they burrow a hole just for themselves. Nobody else is involved. And they're only active for an extremely short time amount of time in the spring so hopefully that's taken care of i don't see myself staying here longer than the year so hopefully i don't have to deal with it again weird things like i've had to deal with the ants before those are always fun never bees be fine if i never have to deal with it again i mean bees are great like i said i just i just don't want to deal with them Hmm. Other than that, um, yeah, weird not driving my car. I haven't done it for a couple of days. Like I, I, I got into it last night to go try to find all that stuff, and it, it, it's been a while. Oh, it was. It felt like I was actually at the intersection, and oh, well, maybe I just didn't click specifically. Either way, I felt I should have got five thousand points for that. Let's see this one. Tosugawa? Tosugawa? Hmm. I mean, we're in Japan. I just don't know if I'm going to see exactly where we are. Um, been occupying myself as best I can. Picked up that Mao and Blade Warband 2. Never played the first one, saw videos on it, and just knew how much of a clusterfucky uh, mess it was. In the sense that you actually had to download. Basically, it, like the best way I heard it described is it was a concept, and then all the mods kind of just made it into an actual game. And granted, it is early access. We got crabs? Yes, we do. Oku Shinsen. I don't think I'm going to... Are we in Okin Okinawa? Or uh, Hoku Shinzen? Hmm. I don't know if I'm going to see it. Like, how close do I got to get to actually see whatever Hoku Shinzen is? I mean, it, it's, it's not popping up here, so... Let's, uh... A little bit, maybe look here. No, he says it should the the way the thing was described is you should be able to do this from the screen. But this one, I can get the country basically. But you know, anything else past that, I I'm 
it's just blurry enough where you really police box it looks like you just can't make anything out on ogawasara ogawas ogawasara is that a thing i i, I don't see like i'll put us here just just I did click a spot, okay. But that's definitely not Okinawa. Like those words being said. Are we in maybe one of these ones? No. I don't see it. I'm not seeing any root signs anywhere. Where the fuck is Is this actually on the mainland? I mean, it's got palm trees. Are they that far north? And, well, north may be the incorrect way of actually looking at these things in the sense that it's more of the climate based off the currents that are off the shore, blah, 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 stuff like that. Where is this? It's beautiful, but where is this? Yeah, Coffee Boss. I should order some Coffee Boss. I've always been curious to actually try that shit. But Mountain Blade Warband, it's been fun so far. Just messing around with it. I'm very bad at it. But. Hmm. Not bad. I'll just I'll just say that. Um, Very uneventful week, honestly. I mean, in my, like, small purview of existence, yes. It's been pretty non-existent. Planning on having a what we've basically decided would be a... I'm just going to guess and see how far off I am. Oh. There's an island over here? I had no idea. Interesting. Ogasawara. Okay. All right. I'll let you have it. Um, basically having ourselves a... Uh, an attempt at a uh, birthday party for my niece. And it basically is going to be where everyone's going to get in a car. And, uh, oh, these are, we got the wind turbines out there, I believe. So it's, I mean, the way private was spelled weirds me out. I feel like we're somewhere in the North Sea, because I believe that's where they have some of these wind farms at, like Privat. Um, yeah, we're all just going to get in cars drive over to the house and just stay in the car and say happy birthday. It's 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 just a weird. But again, it's just what you got to do. Putin this is definitely French. Not English to say the least. Yeah, we've got Okay. We're over here. One of these places. Yes, Belgium has that flag. Netherlands does not have that flag. Let's hit home and maybe look for the Royal North Sea Yacht Club. Are we out of here? I don't see a... Uh... That is not Royal North Sea Yacht Club. I'm going to put us here just so I've actually clicked a place. Seems to be more, yeah, this, this, hmm, there's like a bank in the way. Maybe we're down here? Well, the, the border is not that long. Is there an island offshore? I don't think there's an island off, offshore. Hmm. That's, maybe it's one of the, I don't feel it's one of these. Ben Lines, Oise, Bruga. I don't know. Let's go over here. I mean, I've I, I I said that I'm bad. I've confirmed I am. Well, there's beaches all here, so maybe we're actually on the uh. Well, no, the northern tip kind of it kind of ends there. Unless it's a souvenir shop for Brits and Belgians 
and we're not in Belgium? I really don't think that's the case. Yeah, dot BE. Those are some weird looking bikes. That's interesting art. They look like crushed cans. Where are we? Verkoop Bestoged. I don't think that's any of these places here. We have Bruges, but that's that's we got Zer Bruges. Are we like here? One of these things? EVI Fruit Juice Company? I I don't know. Well we're I feel we're close, but let me just take a drink. It's a uh, laid-back day. I'd have, excuse me, not much energy, feeling a little tired. And hopefully this is just a way to have yourself a uh, mellow limp into your, uh, ah, fuck, we were farther down. A nice little limp into your uh, weekend. Yeah, it's right there. I don't know why I just didn't see that. I was too thought about, like, caught up in that to consider it could have been this. This almost looks like a zoom in on a uh, hair follicle. And that's where the root is. And yeah, whatever. Anyway, <clears throat> yeah, that's our uh, week done. First week of April. Now I can't help but think what it's going to be like six months from now, looking back at this time, or just 10 years in the future. And you just think back, it's like, man, remember that time period? It was fucking weird, wasn't it? This is kind of how it is. Interesting times, they say. Anyway, we're just going to keep doing what we normally do, only with more hand washing. Thank you all for watching. If you have any comments, questions, concerns, complaints, suggestions for maps, anything at all, go ahead and put them in the comments below, along with your likes, favorite comments, subscribes. Week's done. As I've said before, I'll say it again and many more times to come. Go enjoy your week and your weekend. I'll be back here on Monday. Stay smart and safe. Until Monday. We'll see you here. This is a shitty ending. Peace happened way too much. Goodbye.